Welcome back everyone and I'm here again with SPR contributor Jeff Grant and today we're going to be taking a look at that game between the Texas Longhorns and the Oklahoma Sooners. How are you doing this morning Jeff? Doing great Dax. This is always an exciting matchup to talk about the Red River, Red River rivalry especially with the new coach involved. Yeah no doubt man. Now Jeff the Longhorns they've actually dropped three of their last four games due to poor productivity on their offensive side scoring only a total of 54 points over that span. Now, do you think that they, we could actually see Texas break out against the Sooners in this game? That's going to be hard to see now that the Sooners dropped that one against Baylor last week, Dax. I think Bob Stoops will have this team prepared, and Texas just has not been very good offensively. Of course, they're doing it without their regular starter, David Hash, Ash, who actually retired from football after uh, having multiple concussions. So right now it really falls on a young product of Tyron Swoops, and he's really struggling uh, to move the offense consistently. All right, man. Now, how about the fact that the Sooners have built up a reputation of pretty much bouncing back after a regular season loss under longtime head coach Bob Stoops? Now, could that be an indicator that the Sooners will get back on track in the Red River ri rivalry? No team does a better job of bouncing back from a regular season loss than Oklahoma. It really helps to have one of the best head coaches in the country, and that's certainly what Bob Stoops is. They've won 31 consecutive times, Dax, after suffering a regular season loss and playing in the regular season. Of course, that statistic doesn't transfer over to the bowl season, but we're just talking about regular season games. And also, Oklahoma is going to be looking to avenge a really bad loss against Texas in last year's edition of the Red River rivalry. Yeah, man. Now, uh, you did mention something about uh, Tyrone Swoops, uh, the Longhorns quarterback. Now, he turned over the ball just, three t just about three times uh, last week. Now, I know it's always important that uh, the team has to protect the ball, but how important is it for this Texas team in this particular matchup? This is a game that's all about emotion and momentum, Dax. And Charlie Strong, the first-year head coach at Texas, is doing what he can to hold this team together. He's let go of a lot of players. A lot of talented football players are no longer on the roster due to discipline issues, suspensions, and just about everything. So right now, Texas is just trying to hold on until he's able to get his recruits and so if he turns the ball over swoops in this game, like I said, this is a game that often turns into blowouts. 12 of the last 16 have been decided by a double-digit margin, so swoops better take care of the football. All right, my man, so taking all that into account, what's going to be the lean for this game? I'm going to go with the Sooners here. Yes, the tariff is pretty high, but I think Texas expended a lot of energy last week in playing even a higher-ranked opponent in Baylor. They were able to hold uh, steady in that game for a while, but then Baylor ultimately uh, broke through. I think Oklahoma is just as good as Baylor offensively, probably even more balanced at this point of the season, and the Sooners are 23-7 and against the spread following a straight-up loss. So I'm going to back Oklahoma minus 14 against Texas. All right, my man. As always, Jeff, it's a pleasure talking football with you, and thanks for the valuable insights, and look forward to talking about some more tomorrow. Thank you. No problem. And for SBR Picks, this is Dax Floyd. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year round. A real time Vegas style odds monitoring service and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.